go outside. Yeah. They tried to get Polo G after his album release party. When you look at what happened and you see how many cars they bought for one person, it doesn't seem right. It's always after these album release parties. Every single time something happened, there is always an after on the scene. Like at this point, it's becoming some sort of pattern. What happened is his mom said he was on his way to the after party for his album release and they decided to follow him and took him in and the funny thing about this is right what they said and what they came up with and trying to say oh this is the reasons why they're doing this to him and this is why they came to get him it doesn't make sense it doesn't add up them trying to say that oh he had the he and the police officer had a back and forth that is false if that was the case they would have literally done something to him because that's what they do at this point these people have too much power over people and this is why this is happening it has to stop it has to stop what they did is not right they had no reason to do it even the reasons that they're coming up with it's unbelievable it doesn't make sense followed by these people for no reason all because he is a successful person he was literally taunted by these people they are watching him and that's why that happened to me i feel like they tried to take him out what they are saying and the reasons that they are given for doing that for turning up with over 20 people over 20 cars when i saw this video i literally thought to myself polo g caught a body and that's what i thought and then when i read the paper and read what it's actually saying i couldn't believe what they actually wrote this is something that they came up with behind the scenes quick time to put out to the public because of what the mother did because she was smart enough even though she didn't have her phone and her phone was probably dead or something she did it she did it live on someone else's phone trying to tell people to go and flood the department that he's in so nothing wouldn't happen to her son what you are seeing here is not a coincidence this is not a coincidence he was followed by them he was being watched and literally after the album release party isn't that crazy after every album release party something always happens and then who was at the scene there's always a police officer at the scene that's what i'm telling you something is going on and now they're trying to fool people to put out this news and talking about oh this is what he did and this is what he did and it literally don't add up they came up with that fast behind the scenes that's what they came up with quick time to put out to the public makes me feel like if his mom didn't do this live video telling people what's actually going on in that moment then it would have been a different situation because it doesn't add up if something is not right how is it after his album release party while he was on his way he was followed by all these people and then and then his mom made this statement and said if it wasn't for them harassing him those charges wouldn't have been there today there is no reasonable explanation for that situation for them sending over 20 cars even when you watch her live video even when you watch her live video you can tell how worried she was about him even being in their hands and she literally made it clear that he doesn't do all of them stuff he's not gonna do anything to himself because you know how it goes and that's what they try to do so that's what i'm saying she even thought it was weird as well that happened and all these cars are here and stuff and only because this guy is successful he was being watched he is literally being watched and followed and they tried to say to us oh, investigation and stuff that's going on they literally tried to they didn't even give her they didn't even give her no access or anything to him she didn't even have access and the funny thing about it is these people have all these power to where she didn't have to where she them to where she, them, to where there is nothing that she could have done apart from get someone else's phone and make a live video straight away to let people know so people can go and harass the department so they can't do anything to him because of how worried she is she didn't she thought on the spot and she needed to do this live video and she knows she needed to do it because of what they've been doing after the album release party after the album release party it doesn't make sense and then these feds i believe that what i believe happened is that they was literally at the party there was outside around the party around the area and then they noticed when he leave and then they followed him that's what happened they knew exactly where the location was they knew everything about it they know about all his albums all the sales that he's been doing and everything and they literally tried to take him out that's what i believe when i saw that video last night i was actually emotional because i was like there is no way i just kept thinking of Vaughn and the whole situation happened and the album release party the last one they had him and Vaughn doing that last song together 
that's what I'm saying something is going on because why did they decide to send out over 20 cars who made the decision to send out over 20 cars for one person and the sad thing about it is they didn't even have an explanation to give her on the spot they literally tried to come up with an explanation on the spot because guess what his mother is his manager and they probably didn't even notice and they didn't take notice of it until then so what happened is they probably thought that you would have been alone at the release party they wasn't expecting that they wasn't expecting his mother to be there to do this live video on the spot and make it seem to alert the public they wasn't expecting that and that's why they ended up doing that to him and then they realized she was there because she did the live video so they came out and tried to come up with this quick time on the spot there is no way i've never seen someone that she got bail so quick time and given bond quick time i've never seen it it doesn't happen and they tried to cover it up as well they tried to cover it up by taking down two people unnecessary for no reason to make it look like a real situation like a real arrest that's what they did they tried to cover it up that's why i'm like there is something wrong with this situation what happened last night is a perfect example of how they watch these rappers in the industry they are all being watched literally i feel like what they have they don't even own it government does because they are being watched by them 24 7 and they can do anything as what they did last night do fake paperwork and try to put it out to the public to make people believe but this is not real it is not real that explanation and what they tried to say polo g did it's not real it doesn't explain why they came out with all these people to get him it doesn't explain why he was followed it doesn't explain how they even came up with getting the low in the first place unless they wasn't watching and stalking him and that's what happened they were stalking him to the point where they actually sat outside the venue where he was they sat outside and they waited until he started to make a move and then they tried to get him they tried to get polo g the album sales everything all of that it was definitely something going on it could have been a problem possible hit something like that but something is going on and i know when you look at these card readings it says something else is going on this is not a coincidence this didn't just happen like that it didn't just happen they tried to get polo g they tried to take him out the album sales all of that right now his album sales is gonna go through the roof and they might even try to get him again it's even polo g's mom slash his manager she knew it that's why she thought on the spot of doing this live video on someone else's phone to make sure that they didn't do anything to polo g he's out now and he's okay but it's just crazy that in that place all this stuff goes on